It's been reported by dogman.coms at Chris Fetters that Washington offensive coordinator Ryan Grubb is in Tuscaloosa today meeting with Nick Saban and Alabama about the Tide's open offensive coordinator position. Now, Grubb was at Fresno State from 2017 through 2021 before he joined Kalen DeBoer at Washington. He's already been given two raises since the end of the regular season. He was bumped to $1.45 million per season after the Apple Cup win over Washington State and then up to $2 million per year after the Alamo Bowl win over Texas. And those raises were supposed to ward off some of the potential suitors at, like Alabama. Now, if you are an Alabama fan, the scary thing about Grubb is that he has coached under DeBoer basically since 2007 when he joined the coach at the University of Sioux Falls. Now, he then followed him to Eastern Michigan, then to Fresno, and the only season that he did not coach with DeBoer was in 2019, and that was DeBoer's only season at Indiana. Now, he has been the play caller for DeBoer since he returned to Fresno in 2020. This year at Washington, the Huskies ranked number nine in yards per play with 6.7. They were number one in third down conversion percentage at 56.07%. They were number one in least percentage of quarterback sacks, 1.09%. Number one in punts per play, number 10 in points per play, but they were only number 46 in yards per rushing attempt and number 126 in rushing play percentage at 39.65%. I mean, that's less than 40% running the ball. Now, that could be concerning going into the SEC unless Saban knows something that we don't. Now, if Grubb takes the Alabama job, it likely will not be because of money. Grubb was talked to uh, about several head coaching vacancies, and everybody knows that joining Saban's staff is an incredible resume builder. At the end of the day, it's possible that these are two coaches that met to talk about the job, but more so may have just met up to discuss football and philosophy, etc., which a ton of coaches do after the regular season, although, to be honest, not usually right before signing day. And if nothing else, Grubb being in Tuscaloosa this week uh, certainly bears watching, especially the week of signing. Psst. Hey, if you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and of course, jump in the comments. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and subscribe on YouTube or your favorite podcast app. And make sure to leave a nice five-star review. You can follow Gary on Twitter, at GaryWCE. And the show is at Winning Cures. Be sure to check out the merch in our web store and share the show.